Classic Art Readers, Level 2. The Works of Edgar Degas. Copyright 2023. Seed Learning. All rights reserved. Introduction Edgar Degas was a famous Impressionist painter. He was born in Paris, France, though his mother was from New Orleans, USA. He had a big family, with four younger brothers. Like many artists, Degas had other talents. He liked to sculpt and draw. He took many photographs and painted oil paintings, he also liked to do pastel drawings. Many people call Degas an Impressionist painter. Impressionists liked to focus on light and color. However, he said he was a realist. Realists create paintings that show the world in a real way. Degas was fascinated with bodies in motion. Many of his paintings and sculptures are of ballet dancers. He was also interested in horses and horse races. His art shows grace in motion, but it also shows strength and power. Early Life The Degas family was part of the middle class. Life was comfortable for the young Edgar. His father encouraged him to paint and enjoy art. He even started painting at a young age. He studied in Paris from when he was 11 to 18 years old. When he finished his studies, he made an art studio in his home. At 18 years old, Degas was allowed to copy art at the Louvre Museum. At the time, young artists copied famous artworks in order to become better artists. However, Degas' father wanted him to study law. Degas did study law in Paris, but he did not study much. In 1855, Degas began to study at the École des Beaux-Arts, a famous art school. However, he left after only a year. He wanted to travel. In 1856, Degas went to Italy for three years. He stayed with his aunt's family in Naples. There, he studied the famous Renaissance artists. He liked to copy works of different artists. These include Michelangelo and Raphael. Paintings and Works Degas returned to France in 1859. In the 1860s, he showed a number of paintings at exhibitions. He started with history paintings. These were not very popular. He painted different subjects, including some with horses. In 1870, there was a war. During this time, Degas did not paint much. However, in 1872, he visited his family in New Orleans, USA. He painted many paintings of his family. One was even bought by a museum in France. Degas returned to Paris in 1873. But the next year was difficult for the artist. His father died. He learned his brother had a problem, too. His brother owed a lot of money. Degas helped his brother pay the money back. However, he had to sell the family home. Degas needed to earn money. When his father was alive, he got money from his father. Now he needed to sell art to make money. He painted most of his paintings around this time and over the next 12 years. These paintings included 
Portraits at the Stock Exchange. At this time, Degas joined a group of painters called Impressionists. However, Degas did not like being called an Impressionist. He felt different from them. Degas liked to paint realistic pictures of people. He didn't want to show people as perfect. He showed people in everyday life. Degas planned many exhibitions and sold many of his paintings. He earned much more money. He also collected paintings by famous artists like Van Gogh and Cezanne. Degas also enjoyed making sculptures and taking photographs. Although he kept his sculptures private, he shared his photos. In the 1880s, he photographed many people. He took many photos of dancers too. Later life. In 1884, at 50 years old, Degas was a little unhappy with his artworks. He wanted to improve his skills. So, he decided to really focus on his art. He started painting people alone. Degas focused mostly on art for the rest of his life. It was difficult for him to be friendly with people. For this reason, he often painted lonely people in his paintings. He also used unusual angles and bold colors. Much of his success is due to his ability to paint people everyone can relate to. In 1906, George Moore wrote a book about Degas. This made Degas a celebrity at that time. He even sold a painting for 17,000 pounds. That was a lot of money then. Degas had to leave his art studio in 1912. He also had problems with his eyes, so he stopped making art soon after. Degas died in 1917. He was already a celebrity at that time. After his death, many more of his works were found. <laughs>